Hi y'all, it's Jeannie from Bushnell Unscripted. Today I have an unboxing from Fallon Gems. The owner, Crimson, reached out to me to find out if I would be interested in doing a review of their products. Now, I was familiar with their canvases, their diamond painting kits. I had seen some of the advertising and I was interested because their mission to champion mental health with a therapeutic outlet in diamond painting is right in alignment with my life. Whether you know it or not, I am a care partner for someone who has a traumatic brain injury, a TBI, who also has bipolar disorder one, and also has narcissistic personality. So mental health is a huge part of my world. It's one of the reasons why I myself got into diamond painting because I find it very relaxing and therapeutic. And it's also one of the activities that the person I provide care for does as focus work to help with mental health. So I was excited to, to find out how the canvases arrive, how the canvases are, and what it looks like when complete. So that's the journey we're on today with Fallon Gems. This package here of plastic you see in front of me came in a just a regular white poly mailer. This was taped and I just opened the tape. So here's what we have before us. Now as a part of this review, I did purchase the large canvas and received free a smaller one. So the large canvas, so it's got some tape on it. So this is the large canvas and it is their luxury canvas. They have two types of canvases that you can order, a luxury canvas or a standard canvas. And this large one is a luxury canvas. Oh, here's my small one. The small one I received for free. And this is on the standard canvas. As you can see, it's very similar to any budget friendly that you may pick up on Timu, AliExpress. Um, it's just that thicker canvas. Um, they are both poured glue and both kits come with acrylic drills. The luxury canvas, so it comes, so these came wrapped around the styrofoam. There is no um, bag, um, storage bag or storage box or anything like that. The luxury canvas has the scalloped edge with the stitching to help with any fraying. It has a flocked soft back. Really nice glue. There is a large area of excess glue. So if we see here from the black line to here is excess glue. On the side there is a smaller area. A larger area, it goes about to that black line here. And smaller area on top, it goes just above to that G. So quite a bit of excess glue. 
there is a bend here and some marking of something else. Um, thinner plastic. We do have two legends, top and bottom. We do have two pictures, top and bottom, of what it should look like when complete. It is a very beautiful print. Uh, be kind to your mind. This is the Be Kind to Your Mind floral. They have um, another one as well of Be Kind to Your Mind. Um, but I, I do love this print. I think it is gorgeous. Don't have uh, an issue of wrinkling here. Canvas looks nice. I think I just put more wrinkles in than was there. It does have Fallon gems on top. It does not have the size marked on the canvas. This is a 50 by 50. And the price for this is $70 for the luxury 50 by 50 centimeters. So let's look at the legend. We have one through eight and then alphabet and then symbols. That green one there, 28, is a little hard for me to read. So this has quite a bit of color blocking in the background all around that acts as a frame to the design. Now let's check out the rest of it. It is printed, easy to read. Everything does look good. As I tell you every time, open your canvases and make sure the canvases are legible and that every square has a marking. You know, mistakes are made sometimes in printing and it's easier to deal with. Now, while the designs uh, before they should archive or they don't, aren't, aren't carried anymore. Um, everything looks good as far as being able to read it. I'm not having any issues. This one has lettering and this looks like it should be fine. But that is something to pay attention to when you get a canvas that has letters. Sometimes letters don't turn out um, quite like they look like they should, but this one should be beautiful. So that is the soft luxury canvas. Now, let me pick this up here. So these are the drills for this canvas. Comes packaged as we are very familiar with. They do come pre-bagged, pre-kitted up. Love that. <laughs> you know, I personally enjoy that. So you get a, a sheet here. I do like this. Um, this is helpful for those of us who need readers. <laughs> Hi, that'd be me. Guilty as charged. You get another um, image of the canvas. Some instructions. And then this is interesting. You have the number, the symbol, the color, the quantity, the weight, and how many bags. So as we see here, the background is going to have three bags. I like this. I've not seen um, any type of, and you should have 48 bags because it is, well, no, you have 48 bags because one has three. It is 46 colors. This canvas is 46 colors. 
So I do like this kind of log sheet. Um, this is new. Really like this. This would be helpful in making sure that, you know, you have the right amounts. I know that many times people have gotten a canvas that didn't have enough um, drills and maybe if they had included a sheet like this it could have been double checked. Not all the time will that be able to be done but that would be ideal. So they are marked so four four hundred so that right there is four for the symbol four color four hundred don't know what the 1.85a relates to because that says 1.7. I don't know what that number is. Um, this is a square kit. So there's one. So I really appreciate that they come pre-bagged. I love pre-kitted kits. Sometimes this can help you work on multiple kits because you don't have to use multiple systems to kit them. Um, I know it helps for me. I'm more likely to add another kit into the cycle. So I see a little bit of trash there. There's like a super long, just piece of um, acrylic, okay? So a little bit, but the, from what I'm looking at in the bag, these look great. They don't have big divots in the back. Okay. A lot of colors here. There's a little bit of trash. It looks like a little Easter egg. <laughs> Um, but I don't see drills, a lot of drills with skirts around them or, you know, a bunch of just, um, plastic that's hanging around on the sides. Now there's one that looks a little odd, but that's one. Oh, there's a little hitchhiker. So in this instance, when I have bags that are pre-kitted, I just like to go through the bags and make sure there's something in every bag. Again, mistakes happen, we're human. Oh, we've got some pretty there. 5AB413. Okay, that's the number five, which is five. There's two, there's one. So it's here, it's in the outline of the brain throughout, here and there. Um, six, AB498. 6 AB 498 is 6. Okay. Oops. I think I just put my hair there. So that's in this flower, this color here. Oops. Good little hitchhiker. Okay, so those are the two ABs we have in the kit. And then we've got the big bag of background color. C 
So this is the 37 and this is equivalent to three bags. Okay, that's a lot. So love that it's pre-kitted. Everything looks gorgeous. Um, we can go ahead, let's actually take a peek. Well, I'll use one of theirs. So this is the luxury upgraded tool kit. So there's your little white boat. Um, it's not marked, but I would say that's probably a 10. This one's also not marked. You get a glitter placer, some bags, two or three, depending. A squishy. And some tweezers. That tweezer has a little, oops, sorry, malformed in, end on there. So I need to try to get that off. They're not branded. Okay. And some pink wax into. Those would be two squares, but it's just one big one. So that is the luxury upgraded kit. And you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten baggies. Always use my baggies. <laughs> so let's take a look at these ABs in their tray. Doesn't have a lot of slide. Let's try it in. Uh, let's try it in a small one. A mm, little bit of static. This is a Diamond Art Club tray. So let's get a bit better slide for them. And let's see how that looks. Hmm, they look good. They look consistent. Pretty, pretty shiny to add to the outline of the brain. <laughs> Those do not want to come out. Okay, sorry about that. We're, you're like, where did they all go? I <laughs> I got an interruption. I had to go to the door and I came back and started emptying it and realized I wasn't filming. Anywho, so we emptied that. These are really wanting to stick in here. That's okay. Okay, so that's an AB. So let's check out, let's just grab one. It's peachy. Sorry if you hear, um, I have a neighbor who's doing some yard work. So the, as you can see, these are nice drills. That one's a little cupped. So it doesn't want to turn over either because it is so cupped. But they're they're nice um, so far, from what I can see. Let's try it in their tray. Let's 
So this is the Diamond Art Club tray, the mini. And this is the tray that came with the Fallon Gems. So this one is... Well, there you go. It's a little bit harder to shake out. So it, it has quite a bit of cling in this plastic that it doesn't have in this one, which is ironic because I always find these to have a bit of static. But I gotta say, this has got more. So let's clean up our mess, Jeannie. But so far, the drills don't look bad. I definitely am going to, um, I plan on putting this into my rotation now so that I can get to work on it and we'll see how it, it goes. Um, now these drills definitely like this tray better. Oh, Hello. Come out, come out. Okay. So those look good so far. So, in thinking about this is a $70 canvas. This is a part of the, I also want to say this is a part of the wellness collection. There's multiple collections on the site. This is a part of the wellness collection. Um, and it is licensed artwork. I do want to say that. So that is part of a higher price point. They do provide a sticker sheet. Now, this side is a sticker as well. It's just not uh, cut or perforated. And then you have stickers of the the bags and the the drills so if you want to put them in and you got plenty of extras that's nice okay so those are the two sheets you get really really like this that's the first I've ever seen that done move that to the side we've gone over the toolkit we've looked at some drills oh, let me put this back with this toolkit here they are still wee whacking out there. I'm trying to hurry because it's going to get dark soon. Um, and I'm trying to make sure I didn't. Yeah, okay. And then we've got all of our pre bagged drills. Really, really appreciate that. I know some people don't like to work out of these baggies. That's cool. For me, it means less mini suitcases I've got to buy, <laughs> less organizational tools that I need. So I like it. Okay, so there's the drills for this one. Oops. There's a little random one. All right, so we'll put these, I'll put these over here so that I know to put those back. I will, I will, I will. Because I'm always afraid of running out. So any time I find something, I put it right back. All right. Now, this is the free one, which is the standard mini collection. This is from the mini collection. Again, we don't have a size on here. Um... didn't write down the size of this one I will put it in the description below um, I got a camera because I want to do this and frame this and have this on my table at a book signing I'm gonna be doing for my book I am doing a book signing next September in Asheville North Carolina because my book is based in Asheville and I thought this would be so great because um, Sage the main character in my book is a photographer so um this is 21 colors again two legends on either side we have a finished image on both sides 
and um, they have the, their name up at the top. And let's check out this drill field. We have quite a bit of color blocking in the background. Everything looks readable on the canvas, which is great. The S's are very different from the eight, those two and threes. So those can cause a problem on canvases, but here they look great. The canvas looks very clear. I can read everything. We've got one through eight and then the alphabet my favorite. I honestly don't like a lot of symbols. That's just me. I know they're a necessary evil, but they're, they're harder in my opinion. I mean, not to say that numbers and letters can't be, I've been there twos and Z's anyone, but, um, yeah, that looks good. So let's open a little packet. Actually, let's start with a toolkit. So this is the standard tool toolkit. Remember, this was the luxury toolkit. You get a little gray, you get a squishy. Looks like you get the same amount of multi placers. Another glitter pin. This time you have, I lost a little. This time you have um, straight metal tweezers and a pink pad of wax. Okay. So you can easily see that this is the kit for this canvas. And once again, we have the number, the symbol, the color, the quantity, the weight, and the bag number. Everything's a one bag. And as I said, this one has 21 colors. And we have two ABs here. It has a sticker sheet as well. This side is a sticker, but it's not cut. And plenty of extra labels. The ABs are marked on the sticker sheets. So two and three are what we're looking for, what we're what we would be looking for for the ABs, which are Aurora Borealis. So there's a three, there's a three, there's a three. That seems like the outline twos are mixed in here so here and there not complete sections just here and there sparkled throughout here's some threes okay let's take a peek at these We've gotten to the blowing portion of the evening, so it won't be long. There's some more, so let's see how those compare. One is like a gray and one is a darker gray, actually. Bluish gray. And we'll take a peek at those. That's the background, which is peach. Okay, so I'm gonna forgo their kit because I know that that's gonna have quite a bit. Um, let's look at this purple of static. So
nice looking drills. And that one's got a little bit of a divot. So there are some, not everyone, but they are consistent in shape and size. And that really does make a difference, especially on a square canvas, by how they fit together. If you have one that's super big and the next one is super small, you'll have a lot of gapping on your canvas. Um, it's even a pain in a, a circle around canvas, uh, round drills. So those look good. We'll do one more. Lots of sparkle. Have they stopped blowing? I hope so. Let's see. Let's do a darker color. Let's do this navy blue. And these are nice quality bags. They're not the super flimsy bags, which is nice. Um, did we get extra bags? No. So you don't get extra bags in the standard kit. Again, I'm not seeing skirting, a lot of trash, a lot of weird shape. This one. And I'll just have to see how these go down. I mean, we'll have to see. But I will say the canvas has a lot of stick, so I don't anticipate a lot of issue. You know, that's one thing, and if a canvas has good quality stick, it can handle some misshapen drills. When you have poor stick and misshapen drills, you got issues. Alright. Oh my gosh. I think you've blown to the moon. So, I really, really like this. I would love to see more companies doing this. And I really like um, the the slogan that they have at Fallon Gems: "Art meets mindfulness." I'm not really sure if that's our, their official slogan, but it's one of the things I keep seeing repeated on their website, and I really appreciate that. I'm gonna pause this for just a moment. Okay, maybe we're done. <laughs> they were right outside my window. Okay, so. This mini, the camera from the mini collection, is normally priced at $20 for the, now you can also get this in the luxury collection, but this one with this kit is $20 in the standard canvas. And again, the be kind to your mind floral when the luxury edition luxury canvas is a 50 by 50 with the upgraded tool kit both are poured glue both are acrylic drills both are licensed art this would be 70 dollars so for me i received this one for free and there was a 30 percent discount so, and she does offer, there is usually, I don't know if it's a continual thing, but every time I've looked at the website, there is free shipping. And so with free shipping in both kits, it was $49. So I'm curious what you think. Have you purchased from Fallon Gems? Do you think that this is a good value for the price? You can, one of the benefits is you can pick, 
if you want square or round, you can pick if um, what size you want. So I picked this size, the, the 50 by 50, knowing that it was more. The next one up is $85. So you can get, you can choose your sizes. On, on, I don't know if that's every chart, every canvas, but um, that is an option on some of the canvases. This is a woman owned business. I appreciate that and I like to support small businesses that um, are just starting out and especially woman owned. I believe that we have to pick each other up and lift each other up. Um, I will say there is there has been no odor for anything that I've opened. The sometimes canvases will have an odor with the glue. I've not had any problem with that. I did want to do a small comparison while um, while we're looking at this. So when thinking about the canvas here, this canvas, their luxury canvas that has a flock on it, this is the Camelot, which is diamond dots. So this is the pure polyester, okay? It's not as thick as the Camelot. It does have the scalloped edging for frame. Now, the standard does not, okay? The standard is gonna be just like any budget-friendly you're gonna pick up. Um, comparatively to Diamond Art Club, you know, they have the patented tarpaulin, which is very nice, very thick and sturdy. It does have kind of like a flocking on, it's velvet on the back, I guess, um, and has no problem rolling out. Now you've seen this one has not had any problems with staying flat or having issues but Diamond Art Club is thicker. And then comparatively um, on Timu, I would say the top company on, on that I have purchased from on Timu is Center One. This is how their packaging comes, okay? Now remember, okay, so something like Camelot or Diamond Art Club, um, Camelot specifically is going to, this is Camelot, different canvas, is going to come in a box and comes in just a plastic bag, okay, and has their little kit, and of course Diamond Art Club has a box, and this kit, um, the Rebel Princess is a $54.99 to $59.99, let's say $60, $55 to $60 price tag. If you don't make a $75 threshold, you will pay shipping, which the lowest shipping price is $10, um, but they have you know, nice packaging on the outside and their um, improved toolkit, which in their toolkit, just to compare with these price points, you're gonna get their new upgraded tray, some wax, 15 baggies, some putty, um, you get a four and a seven multi-placer. You get one of their pins and you also get this new single placer. So <clears throat> that's in, in their kits. You, know, you also get a similar kit when you buy um, a small, like the Dazzles, the mini Dazzlers kit, you're still gonna, you're gonna get you're going to get a midi, mini tray, and you're going to get this pen. 
um, and the putty and wax and some multi -placers. Whereas something like this, you get um, this, this kit. You get a squishy and um, the pen, the little tray, baggies, and some wax. So just to compare, okay? But I do want to look at center, center wand because when I first felt this, that's what it reminded me of. Again, this is how it comes from Timu. And their toolkit, and I don't have a Dreamer Designs down here, but Dreamer Design, it's Dreamer Designs is thicker than this. It is all on the thinner side, but it is thicker than this. Um, and you get a really nice toolkit and a reusable bag. And you do have, I do have the bag. You do get a, a dust cover for the bags, for the for the canvases. There's no dust cover on these. There's no bag to put them back in. And here's the cool toolkit from Center One. So you get multiple pins with multiple different placers. Squishies for your pins. <laughs> um, glue in a reusable, uh, not glue, wax pads. One, two, three, four, five, six. In that little kit, you get tweezers in their purple shade, resealable baggies, and a purple tray. I really like their trays. And I, I really like their little reusable bags. Um, I am a person who does like to reuse bags like this. So, comparatively, I just want you to get what I like in unboxings is to be able to see, okay, how does this compare? So a center wand kit also comes pre-kitted up, okay? And their canvases do have tape, which I hate, but they are very similar. So they have the scalloped edging They do put on the bottom the canvas size. This is a round with 40 colors, including three ABs, and this has 19,881 diamonds. So I was gonna look. Yeah, it's like, it's like almost exactly the same. It feels the same. It's clearly different. This one has lines, this one has holes, but to me, that is a very similar feel. I will say this is satiny from Center One, where this is not. But it's very, very similar. And um, of course, Center One. I don't know if they have licensed art. Um, that's not their bread and butter of their products. But I will tell you. Um, their prices range and they also have they put everything around that's what I was trying to show you they put everything around a styrofoam and they have it labeled they um, and these lay out very similarly but their prices range from like $8 to 20 so, in looking at value and what you're getting, you know, you do, you are going to pay more for licensed art. Keep that in mind. And their drills, I do believe are acrylic. I don't believe they're resin. Um, but when thinking about value and things, all of, all the pieces matter, right? The packaging, how it comes to you. Um, toolkit. Toolkit has become a really big thing ever since Diamond Art Club has raised the bar. It is a big deal now. Um, so, I'm curious to know what you think. I really felt like, um, just on first impression, I really felt like this was so comparable to the center wand. Um, it's not as thick as Camelot, 
Diamond Dots, Dreamer Design, or of course, Down Art Club. But for $70, it's in that price range. So you do have to compare. I mean, you're, you're going to compare whether, um, as somebody who diamond paints, you will compare. Um, so I'm curious to know what you think. I am going to work this kit and see how it goes see how everything lays down I'm excited I I too love this print and as I've said mental health is there's not a moment of my day that there's not a topic of mental health that comes up so this print is for for whether you are someone who is in the throes of mental health conditions or you are a caregiver it's such an important message be kind to your mind and they do have a lot of canvases that you do not see anywhere else they have of course they have scenic and landscape and fun stuff but they do have a lot that are part of the wellness collection and I appreciate that a lot it is one of the reasons why I was drawn to them so I will get to work on this. I will do a post review when I'm done. Maybe we'll do a whip and chat on this. Um, but I will link all of their information below so you can check out Fallon, Fallon Gems. And I really appreciate them reaching out to me to work with them. I think their message is vital. And um, as I said, uh, Crimson's great to work with. She gets back to you quickly. And, you know, it's, it's one of those situations where you have to start looking at what am I getting what am I getting for the money and where do I want my money to go you know I really believe in supporting small business um, but also everyone does want to get the biggest bang for their buck understandably so I am excited to try these I'll let you know what I think let me know your thoughts and I thank you for being here sticking around for this long one and uh, I hope it was valuable to you. And as always, I hope that you're keeping love and kindness on repeat. And until I see you again, goodbye.